Oh, hey, I'm gonna teach you HTML in about 12 minutes. Okay, cool, let's go. If this is your first time programming, good. HTML is so important, yet so simple to learn. Usually simple stuff isn't that useful, but that's not the case with HTML. It's a great first language for anyone, so here we go. HTML is nothing but a text file, just like Word or Notes. It's the foundation of every web application, as I talk about it here. It's the structure and the skeleton of your page. It's the entry point to every web app, which means every time someone goes to your site, the HTML file is the very first thing that the browser downloads for them before anything else like images and colors and words and buttons and all that good stuff. In this course, we're gonna be making multiple pages together. We'll be working with a version of HTML that's called HTML5. Doesn't particularly mean much. Everybody's been using HTML5 for a while. And for now, there are no plans for HTML6, which is a shame because that's usually how software is released with different versions that support different features. But I guess for now, we're all using HTML5, you know, until the HTML gods decide otherwise. <laughs> we'll talk about elements, the building blocks of every page. We'll learn about all kinds of elements like paragraphs and headings and lists and links and images and audio, video, all that good stuff. We'll talk about attributes, which are a way to specify the behavior of your elements. We'll talk about identifiers, classes and IDs, which later will help us style the web using CSS. It's pretty cool. Writing good, solid HTML is so important because it will directly affect the way you write CSS, so pay attention. What we won't be discussing is the history and the evolution and how it all came about. You can find all that on uh, Wikipedia. So open your IDE, and if you don't know what that is, I tell you about it over here. If you do have one, open it up, and this right here is your canvas, and you are the artist. So let's start. Let's quickly make your first HTML file, and then we'll get started. I'm actually blind, so I'm gonna put on my glasses, and here we go. So this is my desktop. Uh, I'm gonna open my IDE. I use Visual Studio, uh, at least for now. So go to File, New, and it, you just created a, a new file. So I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it in my desktop. I'm gonna call this index.html. The name will make sense later, hopefully. I'm gonna put it here. That's it, this is an empty HTML file. There's nothing in it, obviously. If we go to my desktop, you'll see it's here. If I double click on it, it opens up Safari. There's nothing here, it's a big white screen. There's nothing on it, but we are going to change that. So, let's talk about elements. 